What is up, Prey? Gang! Hello, meine Freunde! Willkommen zu einem neuen Video. Uh, I am going to be checking out a video from Nolf. A lot of you guys have recommended this particular video. It's titled Five Habits I Picked Up in Germany. I'm gonna watch this, then I'm gonna see if this is accurate. If this is accurate, let me know um, and stuff. And in fact, I'm gonna watch a lot of other people's videos as far as like their experiences in Deutschland, um, especially Americans in Deutschland, because I'm an American aspiring to go to Deutschland. One day I will definitely be there living there, so it'll be pretty cool, at least for a little bit, you know. It's dope to kind of live abroad and experience some things. No, I'm fine. So we got, uh, well, before we get started, Let's just get the 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 the, the shout outs out of the way. Follow my main uh no oh my god. Follow my backup channel. My backup channel is linked in the top of the description down below and go ahead and hit me up on Discord if you guys want to be a part of um awesome discussions where you guys teach me a lot about your country. Please join the Discord. The Discord link is also in the description down below. Um, just join. We have a lot of people. In fact, we have a huge influx of German people that are in the Discord that have been teaching me quite a bit. In fact, you guys have the golden opportunity, no matter what country you're from, uh, to react uh, to a lot of videos with me and explain what the videos mean, you know? Because I know a lot of you guys get frustrated when I react to things I don't understand. And I'm appreciating it for one aspect and you guys want me to appreciate it for another. So you guys have the golden opportunity to jump in and inform your boy about how that works. And we can all kind of ring around the rosy pocket full of posies in, in, in you know, um, in harmony. So do those things, like this video, and subscribe to the channel, all right? Subscribe to the channel. We try to give you content every single day because I know a lot of you guys enjoy, enjoy. And I am gonna make a video on what I've learned from Deutschland and I will make other videos as well. I make all kinds of videos, not just reactions, but uh, I have some cooking videos I'm doing for German foods. One of them, you guys are gonna be very, very, very surprised, okay? Very, very, very surprised. <laughs> so, uh, let's go ahead and jump into this and see exactly what we're getting into. But, before we get started, begets! <laughs> comment your answer in the comments down below. What I wanna do today is give you five habits or behaviors that I have picked up living in Germany and I've brought back with me here to the States. Number one, recycling. I made a video about how hard the garbage and recycling process was in Germany. It's still very hard and complicated to me, but it has made me much more conscientious of putting the proper recycling in recycling bins and garbage in the garbage bins and stuff like that using the garbage disposal. Now this kind of goes along with recycling a little- Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. So using the garbage disposal. Now if I think, if, if I'm, th if I'm, thinking what he's about to say correctly. He's probably gonna talk about the garbage disposal in the sink because I'm still sort of kind of getting used to the idea that that is in the sink that I use. And I'm from America. I think that shit is, it still blows my mind that you can throw food in the sink without it clogging the pipes and all you have to do is flip on a light switch and it just grinds it all up into mush and then it goes down a drain somewhere. You just rinse it down with water, I guess. That's a little weird to me. I don't know, it's just me. A little bit, and I've talked about this in a video before, but here in the States, a lot of times when you're done with your food and you didn't eat all of it, you put the leftover food in the sink down the garbage disposal and it goes down through. I throw my food in the trash, honestly, but like I said, that's still something I'm getting used to as an American in America. Isn't that weird? I'm a, I, I told y'all, I'm dead ass about to start a series on what life is like in America as an American. Life in America as a black American, part 105. I'll make a very short series. I feel like it'll be, it's something fun I should do, man. We got a, we got almost 150K, man. I gotta, I gotta start cranking out some series. I think it'll be pretty entertaining. Why not, you know? Sewage system like that. Since I've been home, I have not put any food down the garbage disposal, which I am proud of mostly because I'm eating all my food on my plate so we have good weather so that is something that has changed for me I don't just throw food down the sink anymore good job man I made a couple videos about this but driving in Germany and driving in the States is pretty different in my opinion driving on the highway here the speed limit usually for most of the highway is about 55 miles per hour Absolutely. that's let me, let me check this 
Yep. That's about 88 kilometers per hour. So super, super, super slow. Now in Germany, people are super, super, super slow. I mean, it is slow, but how fast are y'all driving out there, man? Pretty good about staying out of the left lane unless they're passing or driving really, really fast. Here in the States, people are terrible at this. I'm like, I would say most people don't understand that's the process that's supposed to take place on the highway or on the roads. <laughs> Love people just sitting in the left lane driving about. <laughs> He's getting so triggered right now. Man, I remember when I was uh, when I was driving, like when I learned how to drive, and this was actually two years ago. I, I learned very recently how to drive. Um, I would do that shit. I, I, I didn't. I knew that the left lane was the passing lane, but it was crazy because after I passed who I needed to pass, I, I would just cruise in that lane and there'd be like a whole pile of cars behind me. I was a fucking idiot, bro. I was an idiot. I don't do that shit anymore, but that, I was a fucking idiot. Bro. miles an hour, puttering along, not even realizing they're holding up traffic and stuff like this. Nice. After the freedom of driving so fast on the Autobahn, in the left lane and passing people, having to have such a slow speed limit has just made me kind of give up on driving fast. So I just drive in the middle lane at the speed limit very slowly when i get back to germany i'll enjoy the freedom of fast driving again all right yes. this isn't necessarily something just from germany this is just from being in a country where you don't speak the native language very well i can kind of communicate a little bit but since i've been back in the states and i'm living in a native english speaking country i have been a little bit chatty with like store workers or coffee shop workers cafe workers stuff like this because in germany when I communicate with them, I can only really communicate on a very basic level. They like come in and say hello. Oh, so all that time that he wasn't able to communicate it like he wanted to with the people in Germany, it kind of built up. So when he got back to the States, he's like, ah, hello, hello, hello. <laughs> oh, can I have a cappuccino, please? And that's about it. I can't really do, you know, small talk, back and forth banter. How's your day? Blah, 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 stuff like this. So. Now that I can communicate fully with the people that I'm interacting with, I am getting a little bit chatty. I hope I'm not annoying people. And, you know, I'm kind of asking people, hey, how's your day? When you when you done with work? Is everything going well? Now, this last one is something that I really like, and it's very, very subtle, and a lot of people probably don't notice this, but when Germans speak English, they speak it a slightly different way, and they use different words than I would typically choose. It's still proper English, it's still grammatically correct, but sometimes they'll say things differently. And now I've started to do this now, and I just did it right there. I've started to do this. Usually I would say, I've started to do that. So what I've noticed is that a lot of times- Oh, that's not that big of a deal. I, I didn't even notice that shit. Honestly, different strokes for different folks. If you understand what the person's saying, people don't really care, bro. Like, they don't, they don't give a fuck out here, bro. They don't care. The German person will say, hey, we saw a movie over the weekend. This was a very good movie. How I would say that in the past is, hey, we saw a movie this past weekend. It was so good. So a lot of times you'd say it or that instead of this. But I found myself using this a lot more. So I'll say, hey, we went and saw a movie last weekend. This movie was really good. And sometimes people look at me because it sounds a little bit weird but it's still proper English, I'm pretty sure. So I've been doing this a lot. And again, I just did it right there without even thinking. I, in the past, I would say I've been doing that a lot. Like I said, it's totally proper English still. I mean, it's not bad though. It's not, that's not bad at all. That's just, that's not, nobody's gonna pick up on that. Besides, you know, the person who is actually doing it, him, you know? So it's not, that's not bad. But it just sounds a little bit more formal. And I like how this sounds. So those are the five little behaviors, activities, habits, whatever that I've picked up from living in Germany for so long. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe, and I will see you next time. I like his videos, man. He's a really cool dude. Seems like a really fucking cool dude. But yeah, um, definitely interesting. Uh, I can definitely see where the recycling thing would be very like huh, every PTSD from recycling so much. Uh, I know <laughs> people who... Came, came back from countries and myself included that were very like anal about like where to put like trash and stuff like that or like at least trying to recover from having like five different bins for recycling two different bins for like waste and stuff and you know, it was just complicated here you can throw everything in one fucking garbage can get, get it over with you should recycle but it's encouraged not really enforced out here which is you know eh. if you want to save the environment recycle if not do whatever you want um 
but just very interesting very interesting a lot of a lot of things he said where especially the chatty part i can definitely see myself getting into because i know you can't really chat with as many people if you don't understand the language which is why i'm trying to spend as much time now learning german I'm not gonna lie i haven't been messing with du i have not used duolingo in two days and i feel really bad about it this is day two actually so before i go to bed i'm gonna do myself some duolingo and um learn some new deutsch words okay um because if you don't lose it you if you don't use it you'll lose it and i kind of want to expand on that but that's pretty much the end of the video guys like comment subscribe follow my second channel follow me on discord but you'll see that in this next little piece uh let me know if you guys are interested in having a conversation with me on discord or if you want to give me new ideas i also i always uh, i always check the video ideas sec section and I kind of go off of those. So thank you guys so much for watching. And until the next time, I'll see you guys again. Take care. Peace. Hey, what's up? Did you guys subscribe to the channel? Did you subscribe to the channel? Ah, well, if you haven't, make sure you do that. Also, we do have a Discord. The Discord link is always going to be in the description down below on any of my videos. And it's dope. What we do on Discord is pretty simple a lot of you guys are i'm collecting you guys from a bunch of different countries a bunch of different places and you guys want to teach me a whole bunch of stuff you guys can join the discord and teach me anything you can send me any kind of messages and stuff you can actually post memes you could participate in the community and just make friends just go ahead and join the discord and see what, how, what what kind of situation you're getting into for yourself also there's gonna be some giveaways in the future there's gonna be some giveaways but to create some incentive for that i need you guys to follow me on instagram are you guys following me on instagram you know what my Instagram looks like? You probably don't know what my Instagram name is. <laughs> it's right there. Just go ahead and check it out. Check it out. Check it out. It, it's dope. Uh, just follow me on Instagram. I, I do live streams every day. I try to, you know, engage with you guys in every way possible. I know a lot of, a lot, not a lot of creators are very engaging with their fan base. I try to be engaging. So just go ahead and check it out. There's no harm, no foul. Follow me on Twitter too. I honestly am trying to grow my Twitter. <laughs> but I don't really post that often on there. But when I do, you guys will be the first to see whatever post those will be. You know? saying now if you guys want shout outs or whatever i don't know a lot of we have a lot of upcoming independent artists that have been hitting me up as of late i might create a series where i get i favor my international independent artists and stuff and i might promote you guys for free but just it might just be one or two a week you know I and mean, you guys can give me some feedback on that but all to say follow me on my social medias all right if you guys aren't doing that already you need to do that because that's a pretty big deal <laughs> i'll see you guys later but enjoy the content i create it's gonna be random uh reaction videos a lot of a lot of everything reaction videos vlogs challenges cooking videos gaming videos anything you guys suggest when you join my discord or message me on instagram but i'll see you guys soon take care follow me peace